Now, there are two new middle schools opening in Frisco today. Fox Force Hannah Bata live at Wilkinson Middle School with the story. Good morning. Good morning, Shannon and Brandon. Yeah, we're joining you live at Wilkinson Middle School. It is officially in session as of a couple minutes ago, and this is a district Frisco ISD that has rapid development, has had it in the last several years. If you can believe it or not, 20 years ago plus, back in the 90s, mid-90s, this district had just four schools in total. Now fast forward to 2023 with the addition of these two new intermediate schools, the current total in Frisco ISD stands at 77. The district superintendent tells Fox 4 growth over these last couple of years has slowed a bit as far as student population goes. A couple of years ago, district started what it calls a doorbell system on its campuses. That works to uh, stop and screen through a camera each visitor before they walk through the door. This year, every Frisco ISD school will be equipped with that security measure. When you come to the front door, um, you have to have an ID, you ring the doorbell, there's interaction with someone inside, and if you can't, if you can't present an ID and you can't give a reason for being at school, you don't get in. Uh, it's actually kind of funny. I, I went to a school one day and I had forgotten my badge in my car and they wouldn't let me in the school. So they're, they're doing a good job with it. Superintendent also says the district has gotten a better grip on teacher staffing giving these given the statewide shortage. It is still looking to hire a few positions and says that anybody who might be interested should apply on the district's website. Now, uh, even though the, the district is very excited about these new schools and new initiatives, it is like you mentioned starting the school year on a somber note. The district superintendent and the district itself wanted to extend condolences to the family of that student as you mentioned, killed on a bicycle earlier this morning while riding to school. The uh, district ha and as well as police have released very few details about the incident thus far, but we do expect to learn more about it throughout the day. Reporting live in Frisco, I'm Hannah Bata for Good Day.